Welcome to One Minute Tennis Lessons with The Tennis Mentor. In this video, I'm going to show you how your racket path and angle can impact the amount of spin you put onto the tennis ball. Your racket angle is the angle in which your racket strings are pointing as you make contact with the ball. In this video, we're going to keep the racket angle the same, it's pointing in this direction. When we talk about racket path, we're looking at the direction in which the racket is moving as it meets the ball. If your racket path is following the same direction in which the strings are pointing, then you'll be creating a flat shot. This is good for hitting with power. If your racket path is moving in a different direction to the strings, this is how you create spin. Swinging your racket path upwards with your strings pointing this way will create maximum top spin, but minimal power. If your swing path is somewhere in between the two, then you'll be creating an even amount of top spin and power. On the flip side, if your racket path is moving straight downwards, then you'll be creating maximum slice. And if you want to hit slice, but not so much, you would swing slightly in between the two. The bigger the difference between your racket angle and your racket path, the more spin you will impart onto the tennis ball. The closer your swing path and racket angle are, the more power you will get.